Police trying to figure out why a man opened fire on an elderly woman's home. Video shows him firing a gun into the woman's home on Claremont Avenue. Her home and car now riddled with bullets. Police do have extra patrols down in the neighborhood. A Shelby Township woman convicted of stabbing and killing her mother learned her punishment today. Police say Julie Flynn stabbed her mother Joy several times inside the home. She was sentenced to life in prison without parole. A new trial date has been set for former state trooper Mark Bessner. He's the one accused of firing his taser at 15-year-old Damon Grimes. Grimes died after his ATV crashed into a truck. Last week, a judge declared a mistrial, so the new trial date set for April 1st of next year. In Nevada, the search is on for three men who beat an elderly man and stole his car. And we want to let you know that this might be difficult to watch. Security video shows the carjackers walk up and surround the man as he got out of his car. Although the man complies with their demands, they still violently attack him. The man is in the hospital now with substantial injuries. Police are hoping they can quickly find the men responsible. Uh, in New York City, a jury has convicted the man responsible for setting off a bomb in a subway tunnel last year. It was last December, Akayed Ula, or Ola rather, detonated a bomb in the New York City walkway tunnel during the morning rush hour. Six people were hurt in that blast. Ola said he detonated the bomb in the name of ISIS. He was found guilty of six counts, including a number of charges of terrorism. Not sure yet exactly when the sentencing will occur.